Good morning everyone, my name is Lian and today I'm going to show you how to make Ti Shen Sao Zimian, which in English it translates to Ti Shen, means the noodles. This is a very, very traditional dish here from Shanxi province where we are today. And we are being actually blessed with uh, spring showers. This is really, 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 really good for the, farm for the farmers. So it, they actually have a saying that says that uh, spring rain is more valuable than oil. So let's hope it brings a new, a new year full of good harvests. And as you can see here to my left, <coughs> these are wheat fields. They are very, very common here in the area because as we were, we were coming here, we could see them everywhere alongside peach blossoms and other, and other crops. So here in Shanxi, wheat is a really, is a main crop. It's very, very, it's very important, it's very common, and it has given rise to a complete new food culture. And here by my side, uh, well, this is a new friend of ours. <laughs> he has been uh, helping He's, he has been helping all of this time throughout history with farming culture. And uh, here is a, still a mention written to his value throughout history. So one of the, let me tell you where we are right now. We are in a Baiguo community. And Baiguo community basically um, is a set of villages and they are all put together to develop tourism and agriculture together. So they have these two elements that are basically being used to improve people's lives and to increase their outcome. Uh, so let me show you a little bit of the village. Uh, here you're going to see behind me, this is the entrance, this is the entrance to, to the village. And as we can see, it's very peaceful right now. Most of the people uh, are still coming. I think we might be seeing more people in a little while uh, when they come in for lunch. Uh, but right now it's very, very peaceful. The children too are at, at, at school. I think maybe around 5 p.m. Uh, they will be home, so it will be way more lively than it is right now. And besides, it's raining, so I think uh, everyone must be uh, inside too. But the village is very, very peaceful, as you can see right now. And I also hope that you guys can hear a little bit of the birds uh, in the background, because it's just incredible. They are, I think they are also really happy about the, about the rain too. So uh, I come from Beijing, and the city is just so lively, and it's full of cars and traffic all the time. So this is a very good uh, welcome for me. I'm very happy to, to be here and to be enjoying this little bit of peace and quiet uh, for a while. Let me tell you where we are going uh, right now. We are wa walking to Liai's house. So she is waiting for us to help us make the noodles. And um, I haven't, I, I don't know if I told you guys before, but this is my first time actually making Chinese noodles dish. So I'm very, very excited about this. And if uh, you guys think I succeeded, and if I was good at it, just drop me a comment and I'll read it after our show. Uh, but stay with us for a little while. Let me tell you also a little bit about um, wheat here and the story of, of these noodles that we are gonna make. So. Yishan Sao Zimian. It was the name was created, or basically the dish was created around 2,000 years ago when a sister-in-law uh, she wanted to help her nephew uh, basically support him while he studied to go to uh, school. He wanted to become a civil servant, and back then the exam was really really hard and required a lot of it required a lot of studying. Uh, so basically, what she did was she was making these noodles, and they were so good noodles. The soup was so so good that they became famous, and she was able to help him support him throughout the time that they were that they were stu he was studying. At the end, he actually succeeded. He passed him and became a civil servant. Um, what happened then, and the noodles were named uh, for his sister, sister-in-law noodles. But then, because they were having, they 
never been so successful, uh, this recipe of like basically them making money to support the children, that other families, other people also decided to adopt the same strategy to make their sons pay for their son's school. But the thing is that their soup was bad. Their soup was terrible, so they failed completely. And legend says that the children, the sons, are actually embarrassed by that. And so the name of the noodles changed, and it became something along the lines, embarrassed son noodles. So that's, <laughs> that's one of the reasons that the noodles are called this way. But there's also another reason, which is basically that they have minced meat, which is one of the key ingredients in these noodles that we are going to make today. And uh, right now we are already uh, getting closer to Ai's house and I can already see that she's in the garden, she's outside. Uh, I think she might be picking uh, some stuff for the dish we we're going to make today. So we're going to check it out with her and say good morning. Yeah? Ai, good so we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> pick some noodles. I'm just gonna put this here because it's a little bit on the way. This is a little garden that the IE has outside. It's pretty common here in the village to find them outside the houses in the front area actually, and not really on the back, which is more usual in other countries that the garden, the vegetable garden is in the back. But here, no, it is around the house, which I find is a really good idea. And it's very practical. You just come outside and you pick up stuff. So let's see what she has in the garden. IE, this is what? This is Bohua. Okay. So this is mint, so that we can use in the vegh or in the vegetables. No, we can use it in shakes and also in other dishes. Very helpful. Hi, Yona. This is that bread. Bread. Ah, this is tong. Tong. Hmm. Hale. So this here is a spinach bed, and this spinach can also be used to make noodles. So we add the spinach to the wheat and we make these beautiful, beautiful green noodles. They are also very typical here from the region. And in the back, it's spring onions that it's also very common in uh, Chinese dishes. We have this. is Oh, okay. So guys, this is a spring favorite. This is a spring favorite because this is strawberries. I know that most people, and sometimes for children when they live in the cities, they actually don't know what their food looks like before it hits the supermarkets. Uh, but this is a strawberry plant before it grows strawberries. So as you can see, it's like the cutest thing. So around May, mid-May, uh, strawberries will come. I'm not sure if we can vis visit the IE again to come and steal our strawberries, but maybe we can try it out too, because I think they're going to be really, really sweet. This is cai. Okay, so this is cilantro that we also use uh, in cooking. Okay, so these are garlic bolts, and garlic bolts are, uh, we will use it for today's food for the noodles we're going to make today. Okay, so I'm going to I'm going to do this. I'm going to just pick some. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to choose a, a couple of what we're going to do today. Okay, we're going to tap it a little bit to leave all the dirt here. Uh, hold it. Uh, let's <laughs> so this guys is what happens in the countryside. You actually get all dirt. But that's the good part. <laughs> that's the good thing. When you get involved and you actually learn something. So vegetable gardens are very, very useful and are very healthy too. Uh, they're good for our body, they're good for our soul because it gives us some kind of 
um, accomplishment feeling because we grow them, we take care of them, and more importantly too, we can choose what kind of, for example, fertilizers we can use. And these fertilizers, we can use organic fertilizers, for example, and so we choose what we are putting on our bodies and also on the land, on the soil. And this way we can actually avoid soil contamination from fertilizers, which is very common nowadays. Okay, let me walk here. Ah, this is your summer vegetables, right? Yes, yes, yes. For a long time, you can use the seeds to grow. Okay, so this right now is uh, basically it's a winter, uh, winter, no, sorry, it's a summer vegetables. So when we finish eating all of them, she is going to replace it by green beans in that area. And to put the green beans, we're going to use this. So, uh, so this one here, when she plants the beans, she's going to put this, oh, she's going to put this on the soil, just stick it there, and then the beans will grow around it. Just like in the children's book, when we see all those beautiful pictures, so they just grow around it. So she's already ready. She's getting ready for the winter too. Uh, Okay, so this will all be this will all be vegetables coming I think when she has some time to do it. But here we have something also very special. It's a technique that you guys can can use at home. Ah, this is a technique that you guys can use at home uh, because the boxes are very common basically everywhere. I need me and Yoshima. No Okay, so basically, she used the box to plant little, oh, I found sugar side, silly, to plant uh, peppers, green peppers inside. So what we see here, this little thing is, they are not peppers anymore. Don't get too excited because they are not peppers. <laughs> this is just a little bit of grass that it's coming in. But they're going to be beautiful peppers. Why do we use this? This is a bow one. Bow one? Oh, okay. So we're using the box to uh, keep the temperature in and keep the temperature stable so that they can grow uh, as much as they want, completely protected from weather factors, I think. And so as I was telling you guys, the, um, the gardens are very common here in the, in the village. Which is, I think it's, it makes all the sense, right? Because it, how good it is that you can come out and just pick whatever, whatever you want, whenever you want to eat, right? Okay, so this is Li Ai's house. And um, the house here, let me tell you something special about it. Because I think that you guys have, some of them you already seen it. Uh, so outside, the two couplets are very common during Chinese New Year. You can see them outside but there's one thing that I didn't know what it was which is basically these two guys here I took a mention okay so these are basically door gods and I didn't know they existed until coming here so door gods exist to protect the family from evil ghosts and uh, well ghosts in general and evil <laughs> evil spirits basically from all the bad things that you don't want to come and they started uh, they were created in the Tang Dynasty when the emperor wanted to, when the emperor wanted to sleep uh, better, but he had problem with ghosts that he thought was hunting him. So let's go inside the house. <laughs> okay, so this is uh, Li Ai's house. What's that uh, This is a, well, it's a normal, uh, a very common farmhouse, but it's very, very ample. It's really good. So. In that area there is the is the kitchen, is the kitchen where we're gonna make our noodles, and then we have the living room and the bedroom uh, down on the back, and uh, here we have one of the most important uh, features, if you can say it, uh, from the this courtyard, and there is the earth god altar. So the altar is a normally is found on all of the houses on the village that I sneaked a little a little peek into. It's very common. So 
let me, let me ask Ai if they're really everywhere. Ai, this is what? This is the Tujishan. Tujishan? Every house has it? Yes, we can see every house has it. Yes, it has it. So it confirms, my, my suspicion is confirmed. So this altar here is very common uh, in all the houses in the village. And also for almost the same reason as the door gods, which is to protect the family and bring in good harvests, uh, also good luck. So we have the altar here, but normally the altar is closer to the door. It's one meter, two meters away from the door, so that it is the first thing that you see almost if you're on the street or if you're going to the house, it is the first thing you see. So basically keeping all of the bad stuff away as they basically are barred by the, um, by the altar. So now that we are here, we already have our garlic bolts that we're going to use for some cooking. And so we're going to go into the kitchen. I can already smell the, s uh, smell the meat that it's cooking because the IU was gentle enough to get it started for us because it's a little bit, the recipe, I miss uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. because basically the recipe uh, calls for a lot of steps. There's a lot of things to do. Uh, so she already, she already started it. I'm going to put this here. We need to cut oh, it. Bajiga. Step on the top. And I'm also, and I'm also going to change into an apron because there is no way we can cook properly without an apron. And so let me get this ready. I don't know if you guys do this at home or not. You know, like my mom has a ton of them and my grandmother too. Okay, how do I look? Do I look good enough to cook? Some noodles, so let's do this. Oh, I ah, see show. See show. See show. Oh. We're gonna so wash, wash our hands here, even though all what we have is actually soil, so it's not that bad. We're not gonna eat it. Oh, okay, so oh. we already have the oven going, and the meat is already here. Okay, so because the meat is already was already cooking before, we are we are adding our spices now. And so here, let me show you what we have. We have any star here, and we have cinnamon, cinnamon stick too, and there's bay leaves and ginger here. Well, you do know, like Chinese cuisine do call for a lot of ginger, so we're just gonna stir it a little bit. Oh. Okay. And now we're gonna also uh, add a little bit of hot like fire because we're already here. So let me put this here. Oh bang Okay, so we are we are moving this. This is a very traditional. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, uh, okay, so this is a very traditional oven and we need to be careful, otherwise the smoke will all come out and basically come to our faces. But this is basically done and then we're gonna let it fry for a little bit longer. Something that I, what I told you before about the meat being very important is true because the meat, when she's prepared, we basically break the, um, we basically, uh, uh, can it can it can it can it can it okay, so we are, mm. we are adding the vinegar now and this is a traditional vinegar so we'll basically add a little bit of acidic taste. To the, to the, to the meat sauce that we are doing. Okay,我们再把那个鱼调掉，再给它抹香粉。抹香，抹香粉，巧克力，再来一点，然后扫了一点那个味之鲜。哎呦，哎呦，我忘了，我忘了。扫了一点就行。再调一下。然后我们再把
，那么多啊，就是颜色漂亮，那么多颗，颜色漂亮，颜色漂亮。但是如果我们要加，在家里做，我们用那么多颗，嗯，那也没多啥，只要就那个颜色看着好就行。看这还少得很啊啊！红红的时候吃那个石头面的时候，看这颜色漂亮啊。Okay, so there is no basically we don't know how many grams. I cannot tell you at home、啊、慢慢 if you want to do it. 动动这这一下要是中了，还这样就调着就进去就行了。好啊，过来一会儿，火放慢一点。I cannot tell you how many grams of、uh, chili powder we're gonna add、uh, because I was telling that the secret is basically looking at the color. So the red is the red. This 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 is the red. It's something that we need to wait to add a little bit. Otherwise, the meat will basically stick to the pan. We're gonna move it a little bit so it doesn't get stuck to the pan. Okay. So. There is another entrance there, so we're leaving that open. Because we are leaving that open, we don't need to use this one. So when we push this out, basically we're putting air inside, and that's what we're doing. Because yeah, he says we don't need to. Well, this. 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 This And then we'll sprinkle all of this in. So it's going to be super, super rich, full of flavor, full of colors, and it has so many colors on it that they actually say that it brings out all the good luck in it. And also, there it's our、um, the noodles that we're going to cut afterwards. Let me show you because the here it's already cut and it's already spread out. And then we're gonna cut it afterwards to make the noodles. We're gonna let it rest for a little bit and just put it here. 好了，你先尝一下这个味儿。哇，好，尝一下。So now we're gonna. 随便看你瘦肉或者肥肉。肥肥肉。Okay. Oh, 这个。嗯。So now we're gonna try the flavor to see if it's ready to kick out. 咋样？主要一点盐，醋哈，盐，盐起还带一点哈，那行，再来一点盐。嗯，太好吃。好吃哈。好吃，好吃。好吃。嗯。像那个，我那个陕西人说的话是聊杂了。聊杂了。聊杂了,<笑>了,了,了啊！对。聊杂了，杂了。聊杂就是好的很。好。好的很。好的很。好的很。好吃就是聊杂了。<笑>聊杂了，嗯，聊杂了，啊，这说的说的不好呢，是吧？聊杂了，聊杂了，聊杂了，聊杂了，杂了，聊杂了，杂了，聊杂了。Okay, I'm not very good at Chinese language. This is our Shanxi language. Speak Chinese. You, Chinese, ah, you just eat. Just eat that rice. Now let's eat the rice. You see, the rice is soft, the flavor is soft. Oh. Ah. 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 是这个啊啊啊！你敢吃吗？肥肉一点油都没有，你尝一下，里面是不是不能那个油腻？好嘞，这个好。好了，调和好了吧？烧火了。好了好，那行，咱再再来一下，叫一下，这样就可以刮了，可以采出来啊，采出来。来，你给咱来吧。好嘞。
，可以做，用这个吧。啊，用这个可以。好嘞，可以。给它放在这个里面吧。好，盛在这个里面。Okay, guys. So the the meat is ready. So you need to taste both the lean meat and the fat that was cut separately. That's one of the secrets of this dish. Is when you you cook the fat meat first, and then you add in the lean meat. When all of them are cooked like they are right now, you basically take them out of the pan so that you continue doing the rest of the soup. Basically, like you need a two or three steps more before the The meal is ready. You're gonna take it out, all out, oh, and it just smells so good. We how to do it? Eat this way. It's like this. Who can see? Who can see? Who can see? How do we see? I see some more. I can see some more. I can put it in here. Put it in here. Too much. I'm laughing. 你做了多多少？这个是我们吃，我就是一对，是，是五个人吃的是吗？是的。<笑>这个菜你你什么时候做这个菜？这个菜是我提前做好。嗯，咱有可能这这大概反正做食以后，从开始到最后得一个小时。一个小时。嗯，时间越长哈，弄的这个好吃。哦。嗯 The longer you cook it, the better it will taste because of all the flavors come out. Just like now, I can smell all the spices in it, and it's really thick. 来，这下子我来。哦，好，我把这个弄好。好，你去。Well, she clearly has more more experience on this pan than me, <laughs> but that is, but that is fine, but that is fine. All these spoonfuls, and you know that because. This dish, this part of the soup, this is step one on the soup. It has、uh, so many, so much fat in it, and so much oil. You can keep it and in the fridge, and basically just take a spoon of it and add to new soup when you want to. So this is actually a very practical kind of dish too. You just keep it. 咱现在挤油，挤上咱俩弄菜啊，把菜给炒出来。Okay, so now we're gonna do, we're gonna fry the vegetables. 豆腐已经炒了吗？这个豆腐已经炒好了。已经炒好了。啊，咱光只要把这个菜炒出来就行了。好，我先给咱把火都炒。So the the tofu is already half done. You need to fry it a little bit, cut it in these tiny, cute little pieces, and then you're gonna cook it, but only a little bit, not all, because you don't want it to be too soft, right? Because we still have、uh, these vegetables to fry, and then basically we're just gonna put it all together. All together, so you don't want it to overcook. And right now, our oil is added, and you can already feel a little bit the temperature rising. Too. 过热了，等过热了，火马上上来。好。嗯，火上来这过热的。阿姨，这个这个盘子里面可以用多多少多少吃的东西？嗯，这这可能就是我估计哈，做饭十几个人都可以做。十几个人，十几个二十人都可以吃。二十个人都可以吃，<笑>就是啊，给、哦、我打哈。<笑><笑>来，先把这个姜放上。好，放点姜末。OK， 拿一下。好，拿一下。OK， 可以把这个菜倒进来。So, this is the ginger. We're already frying the ginger, and this pan is so big、嗯、that when the IE as like 这样这样这样倒里面去，倒可以倒倒倒倒吗？全部倒，全部倒，好了。And it's so big that when she has like a party of ten or twenty people, she can cook on it. Just here, she doesn't need any other pan. 来，交给你。啊，好嘞。这是我给咱烧锅。While she takes care of the pan, she's gonna pour it a little bit. This is so good. It looks so beautiful. Let me give you a little bit of water. Ah, this 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 点先去这个可以吗？这这个哈，对，可以，可以，嗯，可以。还有吗
，那就啥子，俺们垫上了，要不然垫的都着了。哦，看一下啊，这好，不冷。Okay, so we need to swirl it around. 把这个油也就拆了，立马起来。哦，对，底下浇，还加了一个调和。这个里面放点盐，再来一点胡椒。More salt. 好了，其他调料就不加。这个是是是四方吗？这个是十三香。十三香，嗯。Okay, so that is a uh, spices like basically thirteen spices all mixed together inside. Smells good. Can you imagine this on top of noodles? How happy is this meal gonna be? And you know, guys, this dish is so it requires so many steps that I read that actually was kind of a test for new brides. They had to be good at doing it. Well, it could have been. It's kind of interesting, though. But it does require a lot. This is how I need to do. Do full. Huh? Now we had. Now we add the tofu. There. This is good. Oh, let's cut it. This is cut. Let's 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 cut. 他们什么时候回来呢？他们逢年过节的时候回来，有事了再回来。<笑>有事？什么事？<笑><笑>是想你啊，肯定是想你。Uh, 他们回来了，<笑>就是。<笑> Ai has two boys in her thirties, so but they are but they don't live here. They live in Xi'an. 那个估计这现在差不多了，差不多了。尝一下这个味儿。好嘞，你尝一下，像那个蒜苔儿。Okay, let me take. Uh, let me take. Tofu. Ayo, this is my fault. No, it's not. Ah, good. Okay, okay. Let's add some vegetables. 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 You need to add a little bit of MSG to make it really, really good. Okay, can you now, ma? Okay, la, okay, la. Okay, so now we're gonna take it out. Oh, take it out. 吃过了。还没，我们还没吃。好，那么好，那么好看。好看哈。好看。要不行，你把这个放在这个上面，踩在勺勺里边。好，把这个踩在勺里面。好，这样，来，我来吧。This technique I still have to learn because this one I don't know. Yeah, I'm not as fast. I still suck. I still suck at this. I'm sorry. Hey, you. Hey, you're so fast. I'm fast. I'm fast. I'm fast. I think. 臊子面一定要用那个姜，姜，然后我们加水，对呀、啊。哦，对。这是还差了一个东西，差了什么？啊，是那个，对呀、啊。啊，醋。醋，醋也应该加吗？嗯，加的少来一点点就行。啊，可以加姜吗？哎，别急，我把火开着。Oh. This is the good thing and the bad thing about an oven like this. It is, it's like a workout all the time. 
everything requires a workout because you have to keep adding fire and wood to it. <laughs> Okay, we have to be careful with the oil. And just swim it around a little bit. We still need to wait a little bit. We're going to clean it. Clean this bowl. And just add it there. You can smell the ginger coming alive right now. It's so good. And this is I've never something that I've never seen before which is basically just frying the ginger. This is new to me. It's very interesting. Okay, we're gonna all the flavors around the pan are basically being washed out with the vinegar and yeah, into our pan. <laughs> because we have so many people, we're using a lot of vinegar. And now, the next, next step is that we add the water. Okay. Can you see it still needs more fire. Okay, so we need like a. We need like a. Shrovel Guys, this is what a soup looks like. <laughs> this is so much water. This is definitely for a, for a football team. We're cooking for a football team today. Okay, we're going to put this here. going to put this here and we are going to cover it and it's going to rest for a little bit while we're going to make the noodles. I think because we have so much water, we actually need a big, bigger fire than this. <laughs> <笑>对了好了吧好了咱这现在还有细分糟好不用再分香了这个还不需要啊要是把下面这个拉开以后就不用这个啊好嗯 
Okay, we're gonna clean this up. Take this. Take the old parts too. I'm gonna take it out. to the high key. Just bring it now. Oh,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,
that would exist, I'm not sure. This is not nice. It still needs a little bit. Okay, ready. Are you one lah? Why not under shoshin? Case the shall she. Oh, we need to take it from the other side. Ah, the jada di rachi. This is uh, zo zo mian ma. Zo mian, xia mian, zo mian, xia mian qiao. Huh? Okay, so we have we are already almost done. We are halfway. We only have uh, the noodles left to make, so we are already there. Okay, so we're gonna cover it so that the water can boil. Okay. <笑> We have to open it in a round shape, basically like a circle. It cannot be any other shape because then we're going to fold it in another very specific, uh, specific way. So it needs to be like this in a circle. And very, very thin because the noodles, one of its characteristics is that it's very, very thin. So we have to make it like this, which she's really good at. Okay, we're going to open and put it. And this is not a normal flower. This is another kind of flower. Okay, we add a little bit more. Then we're going to spread it there. Okay, it's yan ma. Okay, guys, so let me try and do this. This is a good technique. Okay, so we're going to use this and start in the, at the back and just pull, pull it up. It's very, it's, it's hard, but it's not hard at the same time. I'm going to try and make it thin and at the, with the same size, with probably, I won't be able to make it all the same. It's like my eyeliner, I can never figure it out. It's one end is always bigger than the other, you know? I really appreciate that on makeup artists. They always get the... They always get... Okay. Oh, maybe. Okay, I think I'm figuring it out. Oh, different size. So you can eat the young. Oh, how easy. Okay, okay, okay. 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 
，这个这个好理好了以后，咱把这个弄来以后，好的这个墙线，来好这儿就再再一个方向，这样，就顺着这个角。啊、oh, 好 ，OK， we're gonna switch positions here and see if I can improve. 对对对啊来，我给咱理一件跟那个细的吧，细的啊，什么意思？细的，细面，细面，这个太粗了，太粗了啊、这个哦哦，太粗了，这样的啊，吃臊子面要细细的面好吃啊，哦、我嗯，这个容易那个吃巧货。I'm failing a little bit at the end part. <笑> Definitely not pretty. Definitely not pretty. But I hope I can get some points for effort. Okay, okay, guys, don't be too mean to me. It's not as easy as it seems. 哎，行了，行了，这剩下的我来吧。好。Now the IE is going to teach us how to make it really, really fast. 好，我来。She's <laughs> like gonna win an award on this one. No more cry. Ah, I'm seven now. Seven, seven, seven. You this time, 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 this 谁告诉你？比你早可能还学的，<笑>妈妈嘛。你的妈妈？嗯。哇，这是祖祖辈辈都会，都是都学着，农村人都是娃都会做饭。做，都肯定的、嗯。你做这个菜的第一次是什么时候？那可能是这个时候，我可能才也十几岁吧。十几岁。农村娃早早去做饭。十几岁，嗯 ，OK， so the I the I you learn how to do this with the with the mom, which is very common in the countryside. Well, everywhere normally, but、uh, she learned how to do it really young, maybe around the, like in her teenage years, I would say. Before she was twenty, for sure. She said she was saying that everyone just had to learn how to cook. True, it's something that everyone should know how to do anyway. 好嘞，那么漂亮，漂亮，对，像头发一样，<笑>像头发，<笑>那还即使还有点擦的，有点擦。好，好，你的这个水开了吗？水可能差不多了，差不多了，对，差不多了，嗯、差不多了，嗯。Hey, let us put some. 小的呢，或者大的？啊，大的、小的都可以。这个可以吗？啊，下面朝。这个可以。好，来大，大的，嗯，好，这个加这个，好。两个可以，够了。啊，现在盖上就行，盖上就他自己啊，好托起。Okay, we just added some some wood to it, and now the water is almost ready. The water is almost ready, so we can we can go and put the mian in it. <laughs> 就是，一弄就脏了，剩最后一点，我一切就行。It's almost done here. 阿姨，我拿了吧、嗯，可以吗？过，行，给。我把这个这个小吧。好，把这个这个捏住这个地方一套。好，一套意思了。行了，放在这。做这样的。最后来的面放在这边。<笑><笑>好，好，放这行了。好，那么房子，那么漂亮。行。好了，咱们这个我我打开。咱们现在把这个臊子啊都放到跟前。哦、oh, ，OK， so now we're gonna. This is the soup. 你把那个锅盖啊，好，咱这放在这儿。Take this away from there. And this is our soup that we're gonna add this 
Oh, Four. Yeah, Not the noodles. The noodles are going there. This is warm enough. Okay, now we have uh, cold water oh, for the noodles. Oh. Can you can you Okay, but we need to wait a little bit more so that the water is really boiling. This is how we can do it. Let's put it in the put this away while everything is waiting to boil. Yes, yes, yes. Let's put it in the this one should be open, right? This one should be open after it's boiled. Yes. Oh, okay. Everything needs to boil here. Even the soup, even though it was made right now. Even that needs to. Then you go like this, just put the water in the bottom. Just put it in the bottom. Now? Yes. Now? Yes. 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 我们是中间那个扣子前面里的就好了。哦，啊，在中间就可以了。中间就可以。啊，OK。So we also need around the borders, and not only on the. 啊，这个货还挖着。我们可以放吗？面条下，可以吗？可以吗？面条了。好，我们再下地吧。好，你你你来下。好，下来锅开了你就下。好，可以放那一放在里边就行了，都给它都给它放在里面。是这样的，这样看这个怕燃啊，放在里面一抖就行了，好，就这样就可以了。这个我们要下一把就行这个开了这个开了哈对这个开了以后咱们可以放这个调料了放一些东西咱这边现在哈把这个啥先放在里面去把这个蒸蒸沫它生的嘛嘛现在放在里面好嗯滚一下然后把这
。对，你看 ，It's really pretty. Now we put it in the cold water just to stop cooking all together. 好，好，给你啊，啊老二，我们这哈，老少一点。好，一口香。We're gonna use only a little bit of the pasta and and not a lot, because the idea is that you keep filling your bowl. Ah, <laughs> good. Okay. 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 好，我们还需要。我们这可可以了，这把这个这个飘菜。啊，现在我们加了。啊、哦，现在放在里面，加到里面去、哦。现在你可以要，要的时候还这样，一甩锅，把下面这个菜挤一碗，把这个菜先放上。好，上面这么再再再来一碗，一碗一勺。啊，第一个，第一个是下面，哦、然后第二个是啊，对，在这里。好，这个去我们去先给那个土鸡生菜啊，挤一碗先给他。Okay, guys. So now this uh, this uh, one that we're gonna take out <laughs> now is a uh, it's very special because it's a local tradition here. So basically, okay, we're gonna this. give a bit of the soup to the gods. We only spill a little bit. Splash. Okay, we just. Ah, you every time do this do this thing, you do this, right? Ah, usually just say, just make a very special soup. Ah, just give it to them. Ah, 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 give it to them. Ah Just leave this here for the AI. She's gonna uh, prepare the rest of us, and we are also going to, we are also going to eat the the noodles over there together. Uh, but we are also gonna eat um, that bowl that we gave to the to the gods. That one is also that one is also for us. But while the AI is uh, preparing, and uh, she very gratefully. Um, Is helping me with with that one, <laughs> and also feeding me. Um, let's talk a little bit about um, the local economy here uh, in uh, Baoji. We are in Baoji city, but here the Baogu community uh, that I told you before is one of the communities that is integrating uh, econom uh, a concept that it's called bowl economy. And bowl economy is exactly like a bowl uh, that the IE is bringing. It's uh, economy sector. This year, it's an economy sector that that is connected to Mian. How is this year? That is connected uh, to South Mian to this dish that we're going to eat right now. Uh, so all the elements that go into into this, the Mian that is made by hand, all of these are created, uh, are be became and were integ integrated in this economic sector of the bowl economy. Uh, so basically, um, it means that you have a tourist region uh, that is being improved by this by this dish. So, for example, by now in 2020, which, which was just last year. The tourist in income in this area, related to food and related to agriculture, and all this project reached 240 million in tourism revenues, which is a very significant number. And only in food, only in restaurants, uh, it reached、uh, 14 million, more or less, if I'm not mistaken. So this is a very、uh, important part of how. Uh, this dish and something so local, so traditional as food, is helping the is helping local people improve their livelihoods and live better and more enjoyable lives. Aye, we are going to start. 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 我我我们怎么说？我
我们再再说一遍吧。啊，对，用陕西话我们怎么说？我们好吃。好吃的聊杂了，聊杂了，<笑>聊杂了，聊杂了，聊杂了，嗯、还可以吗？嗯，说好了吗？说的挺好的，<笑>聊杂了 ，guys。If you want to use 陕西话 ，to say it's delicious， 就 say 太好了啊，太好了，<笑><笑>说错了 ，already saying it wrong。嗯，嗯。我们这哈讲究这个臊子面那个汤，要是煎辣香，是不是可烫了？你说？对呀、啊，煎、啊，嗯，吃、啊、酸辣香，对，这个这个面条还要煎，嗯嗯，辣香，然后这个面哈要泼进光、嗯，是不是？你看也有，嗯，都有，都有哈，都有。Guys, this soup. Is very. Let me tell you a little bit. But this soup, 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 And it's also a little bit acid, acidic because of the vinegar that we are using.、Um, and the meat is also very tasty because it was a little bit, it was fried before. So it's a very, very rich dish. But it is not. I'm making a mess <laughs> here. What it's not is really, really spicy. Even though the color is very intense, it's very, very red. It's not really that spicy, hot, spicy as you would think of in the beginning. You 吃完以后啊，别喝汤。我们这不喝汤。好嘞。嗯。The tradition here, that you saying that I don't need to drink the soup, because in another places you would drink it, but not here. Here, 把那个面就菜吃完就行。嗯，好了，帅，来重新来一碗，来，这个像小孩子一样。过去我们这哈，都是把那个臊子面吃的时候，都呃都端回回过去，然后现在我们就是直接吃，嗯、呃，就在这儿吃。啊啊，好吃，这个是你的，不回汤，这个是你的，你先吃吧，啊、吃你先吃，我去再搁过去，好，吃吃，好。Okay, so this is um. A local tradition where you don't actually drink the you don't drink the soup, but what what happens is that before in in the past they would take the soup back. You don't drink the soup and you put it again in in the pan where you were cooking where we took it before. And basically you would just replenish. 先吃着吧啊，吃着我再去看一下。And you would just replenish the noodles inside your little bowl and just use keep using the same. Uh, soup, just for the flavor and also out of necessity. But fortunately, right now that is, they just don't need it anymore.、Uh, they have、uh, more food available, and so they can use it and do it more frequently also than they used to in the past.、Uh, the thing is that this dish is a, before was a very special dish, only reserved for weddings or for funerals.、Uh, but right now, with all of the restaurants. Uh, having this dish and offering,、uh, it can be more common, and the IE can also make it more frequent, frequently than she used to、uh, in the past. But this dish here is bringing a lot of tourists because its flavor is very unique. And I'm telling you, all the restaurants they don't cook as good as the IE because I tasted one in another restaurant and it wasn't as good. The spices you can't feel them as much. So let me have another bite. Hmm. Really good. It's really good, but me eating is basically like a child. I'm getting all messed up in my face. I imagine.习惯吃我，吃不能我们这现现在臊子面不？嗯，吃过。哦，习惯了。啊，习惯了。好吃着了。好吃。你今天多吃一碗啊。好好吃。<笑>但是阿姨做的跟那个餐厅比较好。<笑>真的
阿姨，今天跳舞有菊花吗？什么花？今天下午。下午哈。下午有菊花吗？下午。没菊花。没菊花。嗯。来，我帮你打扫。行行行行，好好好好好好。I'm gonna stay a little bit longer and help the Ayi do the dishes, clean up a little bit. Because we cannot just come here, take over a house, and then don't clean anything, right? <laughs> so we're going to clean a little bit and spend a little bit of the afternoon with her and uh, see a little bit more of the village. Even though it's raining, it's a good thing. It's a good blessing. So thank you guys for staying with us during this morning. I hope you had fun, and we see you again next time. Hopefully, in some other very good dish, with it, with another good dish included. Thank you. Bye bye. I eat. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye guys. Bye bye. Thank you.